We are with Representative Cindy Ryu from the 32nd District. I have two questions for you today. The first one is broadband. What's happening there? We've looked at two big broadband bills this year. One was House Bill 1336, which gives retail authority to public utility districts and public ports. And that has passed the Senate. The second one was Senate Bill 5383, which has to do with a little bit of public retail authority, but mostly how the state broadband office would coordinate awarding of state and federal funding. And that has passed the House. We have a lot of outstanding need, usually in rural areas, but also a lot of underserved areas. Sure, broadband services might be nearby, but not quite to your house, which doesn't count because it doesn't help you, or it's available, but the speed is too low, or you just can't afford it. And so the 1336, that really helps by allowing, if the private market is not providing it, then public utilities and ports can work on serving you. And then my second question is about your bill to create the Office of Resiliency. That did not move, but you have some good news for us. Yes, the bill did not move itself. However, I did convert the intent of that bill into what we call a proviso, which goes into the budget. And the good news is it is in the House budget. So we're asking for money for a consolidated technology services agency through the chief information officer so that we have a common platform for hosting existing state data on natural hazards risks into a comprehensive multi-hazard statewide geospatial data portal to assist with states hazard risks and resiliency mapping and analysis. So I think it is a efficiency and good government proposal. And lastly, we are almost done with session, just a little bit over a week, really. What is happening now? We are at definitely another phase of our legislative session, and we are now considering bills that the state Senate has considered that are ours, the House bills. And if they touch the hair, even one word on a bill, we have to reconsider it over in the House. We can typically concur. We agree with them because either it improved the bill or it did no harm to the bill or we would not concur or negotiate with them. So lots of exciting times ahead. 